I chose political science as my primary major as I was very interested in political events and systems across the world. This probably started when I was a history student in secondary school and junior college and it started to prompt me to think about contemporary politics across the world and I was inspired by my first module PS1101 in my first semester as a freshman which got me very intrigued about how there were so many diverse subfields covered in political science and I wanted to learn more about them. I guess essentially I wanted to learn more about the world around me and I also chose economics as my second major sometime in my freshman year as I thought that these two fields are actually quite complementary in practice. I think that I'm most interested in international relations, particularly the field of international political economy. I always thought that trade politics was very interesting and I was actually able to pursue this interest in my internships at the Ministry of Trade and Industry this year, where I was able to help with the formulation of trade strategy and I felt that my knowledge of economics and political science were complementary and invaluable in this line of work. I remember my very first midterm exam in PS1101, I was actually quite shocked by how analytical I was expected to be in my writing and it was so different from my previous experiences with exam settings where I could just memorise like chunks of words and write them down. But actually in university we were expected to be more self-directed when it comes to readings and forming our own opinions. So. That was quite a shock, but over the semesters, I was able to take guidance from professors and tutors and improve my writing and analytical skills. And this certainly helped me do better over time. As of now, I'm planning to work in the public sector after graduation. And as earlier explained, I have an interest in international trade and I was able to secure some internships at the Ministry of Trade and Industry in my second year. And I think that this is an area I'm interested to explore more in. And I hope that in my vacation breaks to come, I'll be able to gain more experiences at various industries or stat boards and hopefully find an area that I can contribute to in future. I think that in terms of knowledge and skills, political science has equipped me with a lot of knowledge about global affairs and political events, political systems that makes me well informed and more sensitive to you know, anything related to the world in general. And this is certainly useful for any career that has to do with interactions between people, between countries. And I hope that this will certainly inspire future students to major in political science as is quite a stereotype that we get asked, do you want to be a politician? There's so much more than that to political science. Yeah. And I feel that apart from knowledge, there's a lot of transferable skills that are imparted to political science students like critical thinking, considering new perspectives, and of course communicating effectively as we have to articulate our points well. And I think that this is transferable to almost any career and I think it opens many doors for us. Um, as I matriculated quite a few years back, I don't really have an experience of the new CHS curriculum, but I think that it's definitely beneficial to students, especially in teaching us skills and knowledge that will be useful in our workspaces. And I have an example of a module that I consider interdisciplinary, which was the GT1050 computational thinking module for FESS students. I thought that it was quite daunting at first to have to learn Excel and computational thinking and logic or that as an art student, but eventually it was actually really, really useful. And in my internship experience, I actually had to use those knowledge to churn out data and analyze data logically. So I feel that in future, if students have more modules that teach maybe like data literacy, digital literacy, or any kind of hard skills, soft skills that are useful in their future careers, it will most definitely be beneficial. I think that the most interesting and unique point about FASS is how diverse it is and this stems from how we have so many majors and students from different disciplines and passions come together and I think I experienced this best as a freshman when I participated in Arts Rec under the Rec and Flag Orientation Program and I met so many people with different interests and eventually we went down the path of figuring out our different passions together and I think that's that's what makes FSS so vibrant and I think I really appreciated how 
as freshmen, we were able to have the freedom to try out different majors and disciplines instead of committing to something that we thought we wanted before university and maybe later on finding out we don't really want.